How's it going guys? My name is Hero and this is Hogwarts Legacy Part 3 where we explore Hogsmeade and we finally get a new wand. Sorry for the movements currently out of the room setup, but I'm still editing and I'm still working on stuff on my laptop. So yeah, I'll leave you with the video. Hope you like it enough to leave a like, hit the subscribe button if you want to see more. Drop a comment, share with your friends. Enjoy the video, enjoy yourselves, mad love, God bless. Hero out. Alright, so now it looks like I'm gonna have to go down to the stairs and uh, look for peeps. I am a wizard. Oh, gonna have to switch it up a bit. All right, let's continue. Hey, Clock Tower Courtyard. Lucan's just over there. Sebastian? Where? Oh, there's Sebastian. What's this? How is that not... Accio. Accio? Okay, I mean... How is that not even oh, hurting? Another adventure, are we? Ignacia? Oh, it's Ignacia. Okay, my bad. It's the same, same chick. Alright, so there's Luke, Lucan. Wait, what? Can I help you? Is that Natia? Or Nelly? Whatever her name was. Oh snap, that's a, that's a pendulum. That almost hits my head. Will it hit me? Hit me, hit me, hit me. No, it won't hit me. Okay. Wow, we're really closed in. We're really closed off from everything then. Can All right. I help you? All right, Lucas. Sebastian told me to see you about a club. If Sebastian vouches for you, that's all I need to know. I coordinate duels for crossed ones. A dueling club of sorts. It's invitation only, so you must have really impressed Sebastian. I had to take him down a peg. <laughs> I'm flattered to hear that. Sebastian's not a bad duelist either. Imagine it's quite something to see the two of you duel. How does cross ones work exactly? You show up, I match you with other duelists, and whoever is still standing in the end wins. It's our way of determining the school's greatest duelist once and for all. And to liven things up, the winner is awarded a prize. Interested? Hmm. All right, I'm I'm in. Of course. It's a prize after Dueling's all. an entertaining pastime. I agree. Besides, in crossed ones, you could duel with a partner if you like. Your first time, I'll pair you with Sebastian. Next time, you'll need to bring a partner along or duel alone. I would. So. Can I would bring a partner along, ring. but I would also, you know, team up. I I'll do Get things in the alone, ring. But Spectacular! I'll bring in Sebastian. Let the fireworks begin! Alright. Who, who are we fighting against? We'll make you regret signing up. Dang. Alright. Break through yellow shields with control spells like the levitation spell Levioso. Target lock... Target lock lets you track enemies without aiming. Use R to change targets while being locked. Who's gonna hit me? That's the question. Who am I gonna fight? Confringo. Let me open. You're better than that. Let me open. There you go. Dang, I'm just knocking him. Oh, oh snap! <laughs> Oh, get out of there! Act like a winner. There we go, victory. Glad I didn't bet on that round. <laughs> nice. Nice. That work. was fun. Sebastian wasn't wrong about you. There's strong competition ahead, but keep this up, and you could be the next school champion. Brilliant. Count me in. I shall. Now, it takes I just hope that there's no duels, like curses or anything like that. Check with me later. I may have something lined up for you. Again, congratulations on your first Crossed Ones victory. Well fought. Well fought indeed. Hope to see you back here again. That was a pretty good side quest. Complete side relationship quest, Crossed Ones, round one. Nice. Relationships, no relationship quests, no side quests available. But there is the main, the main one, which is Weasley after class. I'm a required level two. You know, this actually reminds me of Genshin Impact, because we have to be a certain level to enter a dungeon of sorts. 
Just wait till I've grown a bit. Then we'll see how well you do. Definitely. I feel sorry for your next opponent. <laughs> GG's, I guess. All right. Bing. Dude, there's nothing? What? There can't be... There can't be nothing. There's always something here in Hogwarts. What's going on? Oh, snap. What the... Open that here. Henry Transfiguration Courtyard. Indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Thank you. And there's a chest. Where's the chest? Okay. Uh, pet the cat. I'm pretty sure the cat has a has an idea of where the chest is. Where's the chest at? You know where the chest at? Revelio. You've got to be kidding me. Is the chest here? An incendio? Do we need an incendio here? Oh, through there. I'm dumb. <laughs> Open the door. Wow. Just walk through there like nothing. It had to be that. Okay. Revelio. Where are you going? Where are you going? Let me go. There we go. Get your Accio. Revelio. Okay, so it's a floating paper. Accio. There we go. So that's what so that's what I should have been doing. Why can't I hit this? There we thank you. Okay, alrighty. Let's uh go meet with Professor Weasley. I think we're I think we're cat caught up. Uh Cat I will pet as many cats as possible. If only they had dogs. My bad. I'm dumb. Meet Professor Weasley in Transfiguration Classroom. Well, hold on for a second. I want I want to see if there's any chests here. There's nothing here. Alright. Run, 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 run. You know, I, I started thinking about it. Will my character ever shower? Alright. Oh, snap. Hold on. Uh, quest begin. Let's go. What about the room, Professor? I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. Oh, excuse, Deke. Ah, there you are. I Cut trust scene. your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit during your brief detour near... What was it you said? Some ruins? I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me. Isn't there? Hasn't Professor Fig said anything? Have you and Professor Fig not discussed my training? He continues to be reticent about the details. Oh. Mentioning only a few spells. Revelio, was it? And Lumos? Dude, I popped That's my correct, back. Professor. That I see. Like trying to get a sonnet from a streeler. Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Okay. Professor Ronan mentioned that, of course. Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Now... Regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier, we've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spellcrafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. <gasps> You've managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. Are we seriously going to get into wands? Let's go. Okay. Cool. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. 
help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. Uh, Natty. Uh, uh, Sebastian is a little bit sus to this point because he's Slytherin. I, I'm, not, I'm not being stereotypical, but I'll, I'll go with Natty. I'd like to go with Natty. Excellent choice. Miss Onai is one of our most talented students. And she knows the area. She'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. Hmm, okay. Okay, I, I can now see what happened. So, if I had, had I not chosen Natty, then Sebastian would have probably led me to the, to the bad guys. So that's interesting. Uh, speak to Professor Ronan to receive your first assignment. Assignments are types of quests given to you by Hogwarts professors that, when completed, reward you with new spells. The reward for completing your first assignment will be the Mending Charm Reparo, which is required to complete other quests. You can track assignments and their progress in the field quests menu of your field guide. Awesome. All right, Professor Ronan would like to speak with me about some additional assignments, and that's the case. Revelio. There you go. There was a Revelio right there. I saw that. I saw that. Alrighty. What else? What else? What else? Is there another one? Oh, is that a chest? That's a chest. Give me that. Thirty-nine chalets. And this is a Reparo. No, it's Alocomora. Revelio. It's a locomora for sure, but it's not there. Okay, let's see. What else? What else? What else? All right, let's go oh, with nice Professor to see Ronan. You, my young friend. Nice to see you too, ma'am. Hey, Ronan. Hey, yo. Is that Hedwig? That looks like an owl. It's so cool. There's that. That's a really white owl. It looks like Hedwig or. Or, like, Hedwig's ancestor, since this is based on the 1890s. Ah, there you are. Hello. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed I do, and an exceedingly useful one at that, the mending charm, Repero. Fixes things right up, makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. Hmm. It seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for today. See them through and then report back to me. <laughs> we will have you casting Ropero in no time. All right, and what is the purpose of the tasks? Actually, that's a good question. A little insight, a little insight, rather than just be, you know, a worker. Why must I first complete tasks to learn Reparo? No lesson or lecture can compare to first-hand experience, and these tasks should provide you with just that. Such experience is invaluable when mastering any new bit of magic. All righty, I'll complete the I'll task. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. Okay, alrighty. Wait, what is he doing? Is he making birds fly? Oh, he's making them fly. <laughs> I'm like, what is going on? Alrighty, so... Collect the flying paper near the broken statue. Collect the flying page in the Defense Against the Dark Arts Tower. Okay. This is the wrong area. Got it. This is the area, got it. There we go, 11 to 15. <laughs> and also to go to the Defense Against the Dark Arts Tower. Cool. All right, no no worries. We are Gucci. All right, so let's continue. Learn Reparo from Professor Ronan. And... Oh my gosh, could you move? Thank you. Move, Slytherin. I'm a Gryffindor. I'm a poorly dressed Gryffindor, but I'm a, but I'm a Gryffindor. What do we got here? Move over to here. Move, boy! Oh, snap, what the? That's new. 
interact. Well, don't mind if I do. Stylish vest school uniform. And it says it's a downer, so I'm assuming that this type of gear is gonna weigh me down. It's gonna make me lose... Yep, it's definitely gonna make me lose... Wait a minute. It says, perfect vest, uniform, well-appointed. And this is stylish vest, uniform. Is this the same thing? Oh, definitely the same thing. I'm just gonna leave it as is. Alright, let's continue. Oh, I got trapped. No worries. Man, these staircases are really hard. Really steep. I'm watching you. I'm watching you. Rebellion. Alright, let's continue. Looks like there's something here. This looks golden, that means it looks important. And... Dude, there's something inside! I don't know where it at. Where I don't know where is it. Bleh. There you are! Oh, look at these knights. Defendo... Dude, Defendo is, is an old spell, like from Chamber of Secrets. Jeez Louise, it's so old. Rebellion. I knew it! Let's just continue on words here. Bell Tower Courtyard. Open the chest. Wiganweld Potion. Man, Rebellion. we are looking for these really good. We're looking for these real fast. All I have at home are brothers. Hey, that's Natty. I don't want to. I don't want to talk to her yet. I, I know there's more here that I want to look at, like this. Ooh, level eight. Let's go. Rebellion. Let's go, baby. <laughs> okay, this is this is way too battle. <laughs> I don't think I'm ready for this just yet. You're not. Quests may have level or tool requirements in order to activate them. Check the quest log or your current task. Alright, so let's see. My quest or quest one assignment. Uh, visit Hogsmeade. Welcome to Hogsmeade. Professor Ronan's assignment. To look for Reparo. Okay, makes sense. Perhaps I'll come back to this. Yeah, yeah, I knew it. It's kind of like a Genshin Impact storyline where I need to literally I've taken go through each, the day in go door. through each item, go through like specific side quests. Return to Professor Ronan. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah I forgot, I forgot, I forgot. Oh my gosh, I'm so dumb. Some of us are tied to yeah, I forgot how to get there. Let's go upwards. Let's go uphill. <laughs> Yo! <laughs> he literally, <laughs> he literally just pushed him. Like, shut up! <laughs> oh. <gasps> Did they seriously? Do they have the cosmetics? Did they really add cosmetics like these? I like cosmetics like these. Oh my gosh! Can I have this? I want to look like a fierce warrior. I don't want to look like an idiot all the time. I mean, look at me. Wow, oh, that took a while to render. All right, let's go, Professor Ronan. I trust the preliminary tasks weren't too much trouble. Were they? No, they were. I completed the assignments, Professor. Marvelous! You clearly know your way around basic charms. Let us give the old mending charm a try, then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Remember, your wand is a conduit of your magic. Alrighty, so combinations. And I really like how he moves with the wand. With I really like how he's moving uh, the wand with... Uh, with the symbol as well. Nice. Reparo, new spell unlocked. The mending charm. Reparo can be used to mend broken objects and pieces of the environment. 
Let's That's go! It. We learned from the puddle! If you would like to practice mending something, have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. It allegedly symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps a jilted lover thought it too accurate and lashed out. Oh, you mean that? Okay. Complete quest. Alright, let's uh let's do that. Repair. Nicely done. Works like a charm, doesn't it? <laughs> yes it does. Cool. Now Rebellion. Can we open this? Can we read this? Can we not? Oh man, I can't go through. I can't go there's stairs nearby? They feel like stairs. Alright, so my level is level eight, but my quest <clears throat> required level two and my reparo spell. Oh, that, that explains why that explains why it was locked. My bad. Okay. Let's go up the hills. Oh, my bad. <laughs> Yo, I keep forgetting that it's not really linear, it's just ugh. Oh, okay, makes sense. Alright, now we are ready to look over this. Alright, Natia Hello. or Natty. Looking for me? Natty, I hope I haven't kept you waiting long. Not at all. Professor Weasley tells me that you need to go to Hogsbeat. You must be eager to have your own things again. And to see the village. Yes. I've been looking forward to it. Good. Shall we set off? I intend to give you a first-rate Hogsmeade experience. Sure, because you never know who might who might be a who might need help. All right, to Hogwarts, the open world. Look at all this. Oh my gosh, this, is gonna, this looks so nice. To accompany you. This really? looks so beautiful. Yes. I had planned to extend an invitation to you myself. I thought you might enjoy a better be in the village. <laughs> the timing of Professor Weasley's Revelio. Yeah, it practically was. Okay, so that door is opening. Wow, these these outfits look amazing. What are they? Ow! That literally went through. Oh, what's this? Rebellion. What's this? Oh, it's a carriage ride. I need to catch up on my letter writing. I think my owl could be cobweb. Okay, and we go. Could have sworn that could have sworn that this could have had like a field page guide, but it doesn't. Alright. Follow me! Hey yo, let's go. I cannot Hogwarts tell you North how nice exit. it is to breathe fresh air after being cooped up in ancient rooms. Great tell me about mistake it. to take a elective class, believe me. I believe you. Though I suppose you would not you know really call it elective when your mother was the one who elected that you take it. Eh? Come on, let's go. Sprint. Hogsmeade is beautiful this time of year. Everyone will tell you to visit at Christmas, but that's one of the few times of year I would rather be indoors. <laughs> not much for the cold, are you? Oh, I do not mind the cold so much, but it has taken some getting used to. I did not grow up around snow. Bro, oh, this outfit looks nice. Oh, wait, over here. What? I often spot lacewing flies in this area. Oh? What's so special about them? They are interesting to look at. But if you stew them, you can also use them in potion making. Just wanted to make sure. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Can I sprint? I want to sprint. Bruh. Look, from the Forbidden Forest. Hippogriffs. I wonder if something startled them. I heard rumors that hippogriffs had been spotted nearby. Wow, hippogriffs that close. That's pretty dangerous. He's already seen the hippogriffs. Absolutely. Likely already named them too. Wait, can I just run up to them and catch them? I think I just did. I just caught up. I just think I just caught them. Let's go. Alrighty then. That's the forbidden forest on the left. It's off limits to students. 
as the name implies. Yeah, I Why can tell. is it off limits? The professors claim it is too dangerous. I think that calling it forbidden only makes it more alluring. Ah, yeah, it there's does. There's meat over the crest. Pass that ruin. Catch. Catch. Catching lacewing flies like no tomorrow. Alright, let's go, Naughty. Bro, I want that outfit so badly. Imagine I get the outfit and then I just forget. And then I just, like, then I'm like, I'm I over it. I spend all of my time exploring if I could. I confess I was surprised when Professor Weasley mentioned that you knew the area, since you're relatively new here. She said that? Leaping toadstool caps, okay. Mm. She knows more about me than I had thought. I will say. There's a lot of well, flowers I here. Certainly learn There's a, a lot of plants here. Class, much can be gleaned outside of the castle walls. How are you settling in? I remember the weeks that followed my arrival feeling quite strange. Everything was so new and unfamiliar. The lake? I'm getting used to things. What about you? Do you finally feel settled? I still miss my homeland. But it is beautiful here too. And getting out of the castle and exploring helped me to adjust quite a bit. Hogwarts has become something of a home now, I would say. Hopefully oh. it will for you too. A cat. Not a single student got their sleeping I'm gonna pet the cat. The I don't know how many cats we need to pet, but I'm petting the cat. You should hear there we go. <laughs> Alright, let's go, Natsai. Will it work? Will it Mr. work? Moon. And then boom. He is the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Mr. Moon. Hello, Mr. Moon. Have you met our new fifth year? Pleasure. Um, you might want to turn back, Miss On I. Uh, turn and run. Is everything all right, sir? Oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. What did Mr. Moon? Jemmy, guys, Dudley and Airy and mm, terrifying. Interesting. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. The demi guys. Good luck to both of you. Of course. Poor Mr. Moon. A demi guys. I think he had too much fun in the village. I will say that I have never seen him in such a state. What is this? These are nearly there. There is much to see outside of the castle walls, not just hugs meat. I am happy to explore whenever. Oh, you a like. moonstone! Oh shoot! Rumors being what they are about goblins and such, it might be nice to have a friend with you. I didn't know. I didn't know I'll that was that a thing. Mind, Natty. Thank you. Wait, what did Natty say? Dang it. I guess I guess to stay away from demi guys. That's that's like the ultimate thing. Okay, leaping toadstool caps are very very are very common. I just noticed that. Not even a single not even a single firefly. Or at least not yet. Hey, isn't this Hagrid's place? Or it's close to Hagrid. Oh no, but this is Hawksmead. Hawksmead is where we're going to get our our wand for sure. And here we are. It is hard to know where to start. Oh, I can the tell. The Three Broomsticks is the place for Bacchio. And you can get any sweet you can imagine at home. Give me that. I could not choose a favorite shop here. It changes with every visit. Oh, so I, I found a tell you page from Hogsmeade then. To find cool. everything you need in Hogsmeade. Rebellion. Hey, yo. Challenges. Field pages guide. Did I get this? Oh, snap, let's go. Zonko's chief prankster spectacles. <laughs> and then this one is gear Zonko's chief prankster wand. Yo, we just need we just need a few more from Hogwarts. Let's go. I that's where I need to explore more. This 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 is the part where I need to explore more for sure. Revelio. All right, let's look. Let's look, look, look. Follow Natty to Hawksmead. Really glad Professor that I'm going through a good Weezy path. said that you need to get potion recipes, spellcraft, some seeds, and... A new wand. Of course! You will enjoy Mr. Ollivander, and I am keen to see what you will do with a wand of your own. You should be able to collect everything you need and still have time to explore a little as well. Experience Hogsmead at your own pace. We can meet up in the town circle when you are finished. Nice. 
Enjoy okay. yourself. I will see you soon. Now, now we can cause havoc everywhere. Let's see bookshop. All right. Is it really in here? No way. Oh my gosh. I'm so sorry, dude. <laughs> oh gosh. All right. Thomas Brown. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spellcrafts Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda student. I thought Matilda I Weasley. Okay, so it's an ancestor from I Weasley. I am the proprietor here. Thomas Brown. I take it you've had a conjuring lesson then. I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. Ah, but you will soon enough. It is magic at its purest. Oh. Creating something out of nothing. Of course, it is not without complexity, but that is where my spellcrafts come in. Stay the course, and you could soon impress even Professor Weasley. That's certainly something to aspire to, Mr. Brown. I look forward to that day. Yes, yes, and you. And I too see in it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. But I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. For now, let's get the spellcrafts you need. Yes, a please. A potting table and a potion station. Yes? I believe so, sir. Good. Nothing like being potting able to grow your station. own ingredients and brew what you want when you want. Let's have a look. Let's look at what we have, shall we? Give me a second. Okay, let's see. So we got supplies, which is a potting table with a small pot purchase, and a small potions station spellcraft. If you're interested, feel free to take a look around at the rest of my inventory. Beast sto beast toy box. How much do I have? I have 507 chilies. Jeez. Dang, all this is expensive. Level 9! Boop! <laughs> Let's go! West Hawksmeat, Flu Flames location discovered. Where? Oh, there. <laughs> okay. Rebellion. Bro, I wanted that outfit for a really long time. I finally got it. Welcome to J. Pippin's Pushins. Thank you. A seafoam nightwear? Is this pajamas? No way, that's pajamas. Is it pajamas? Is it really? It's pajamas. Oh my gosh, it's pajamas. <laughs> right. Pardon me, sir. That's oh, really convenient goodness. that, that well, I, I was looking Bella for it. I was Miss looking Lama. for the potions area. Not that she deigns to come here. Though, I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. <laughs> How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. Are potions really that versatile? They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses, and I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? Oh gosh, all right. I feel, I, I hope I we got all of them. Today? I hope we got all of them. Let's see, uh, Endurance Potion Recipe, recipe for a potion that causes a rocky film to develop <laughs> on, the custom, on the consumer's skin. A rocky film to develop on a consumer's skin, helping to protect them from harm. Hmm. Interesting. I mean, I still need to get them. 
Wigan Weld Potion Recipe. Recipe for a healing potion. I need that. Feel free to take a look at the rest of my inventory. I'm gonna need that. Or come back another time if you're in a rush today. I have 166, uh, but what's this one? Invisibility Potion Recipe. Recipe for a potion that makes the drinker practically invisible. Ayo, hey how you doing? The magic neep. Mm-hmm. Whatever. Hey, there's oh, a field page. There. Hi there. All right, Timothy Teasdale. Talk. Let's go. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. Oh, the ditany for the new fifth year. Holy cow, he I has a big it, beard. That's you then. Merlin's beard. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. You must be positively reeling from it all. Not at all. I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, bravo. Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way. And this is my shop, the Magic Neep. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. Can't very well be in the thick of things if I'm hidden away inside now, can I? I suppose not. In addition to seeds, I have plenty of plants. Grow everything myself. My speciality is potion ingredients. Even Pippin purchases from me. But what say we get you a packet of Dittany seeds? Marketing. <laughs> Let me guess. You're after something fresh. Yes, yes I am. Especially with Dittany seed. Do have a look around. Plenty of ingredients to pique your interest, I'd wager. I actually do. I'm actually interested. There's a lot more ingredients here. There's mallow sweet leaves, didney leaves, flux weed. I can get all these like in the wild, but still. Okay, you know what? I think I'm ready now. I'm at level 11. Let's do it. What? Your gear slots are full. Dang it. <laughs> I, I need to store. I need to store things already. All right, let's go. I'll be right with... Ah, it's you. Um, just a moment, please. Dude, you look so fancier than, than, in, the, than in the movie. Uh, mm, hello, sir. I'm looking for... For a new wand, yes. It's about time. Yes, uh, about time. Well, you're our new fifth-year student, are you not? Yes. Oh, what am I saying? Of course you are. Gerbold Ollivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest one makers in the world. It's a pleasure to meet you, truly. Now, come with me. Let's find you the perfect one, shall we? Hmm, uh, no, 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 not you. Um, ah, yes, yes. Hmm. Powerful core, ten and a half inches. Hmm, you might do. Here, give this one a try. Yo, well, that looks ahead, nice. Swish. That. Hmm. How odd. Uh, once more, come on, really swish it. Oh dear. Nope, that's not the one for you. Well, this isn't a good match at all, is it? <laughs> uh, um. We'll find you something, not to worry. Mm. No, not you. Uh, uh, mm. Perhaps. Yes. A rare wood, 13 and 3 quarter inches, dragon heart string. Dragon? I like Let's the sound of that. Let's give this one a try. Really? That one? Oh, oh, oh snap, oh, I thought so. Oh, goodness. Looks like it's back to the shelf for you. Yep, I thought so. Uh, this is proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. How perplexing. Um, where are you? Perhaps you? Uh, ah, there you are. Oh, no way. Yes, I think you might be the one. Here, take it. How does it look? S 
stock, honey brown, wood type holly, core type phoenix feather, flexibility swishy, wand length 12 and a half inches. Wand style. Oh, I get to design my own wand. Oh, okay. My bad. All right, so this looks what? This is is this elder wand? Yes, indeed. Ring dark brown, honey brown. Oh, okay, makes sense. Makes 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 sense. Makes sense. How intriguing. The image the images render a little bit weird. Warm brown. Uh no, I like dark brown. Wood type 12 and a half inches. Is it is it possible to maybe go a little bit higher? Let's go let's go higher. Curious indeed. <laughs> 14 and a half inches. Let's go. I like that. Strong. No. Uh How intriguing. I'll just do 12 inches. Like that's the mid that's the medium. Wood type holly, hazel. Hawthorn. Do they even Curious does it even indeed. matter? I mean, it's not rendering. It's not rendering the image itself. Blackthorn, black walnut, shadar, cherry, dogborn, ebony, elder. Ooh, elder? Mm -hmm. Elder? Like, as in the most powerful wand ever. English oak, fir, hawthorn, hazel. I like hazel. Flexibility, swishy. Curious indeed. Slightly springy. You stop. Reasonably supple. And what is this? Is this wand core options? The feather of a phoenix that serves as the core of a wand capable of producing a great range of magic. Unicorn hair, the hair of a unicorn that serves as the core of a wand known for producing consistent magic. And dragon heartstring that serves as the core of a wand known for producing powerful magic. Ooh. Producing a great range of magic. Actually, I want my, my range. Ah, I'm going to do that. Phoenix feather. Exceptionally rare and a core with a strong sense of initiative course uh that this is this looks like hermione's nope how intriguing no no none of this none of this actually calls to my attention to be honest it's all weird this looks like the bone from from harry potter <laughs> curious indeed that looks like the bone from voldemort's actually so yeah let's look here Ringed buff. How intriguing. Be quiet. <laughs> so Hazel, Phoenix Weather, Whippy, 12 inches. Uh, no. Really isn't much of a choice, Curious right? indeed. It's really not much of a choice. We'll go with a uh, dark brown stock. My own wand. Or this one. This one's similar to the older one, and I kind of want that. <laughs> yeah, I'll purchase. I'll use this one. What do you think? How does it feel? Extraordinary. <laughs> another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> I took a long ah. time getting that. <laughs> now, how did that feel? Good. Different. I sense the sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you, just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. Of course. And a phoenix feather core is terribly selective. This will be an excellent match indeed. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised at your new one's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. Let's go! Well, that's everything. Better go and find Natty. There is Natsia, or Natty, in this case. Ah. I have everything. I see what you meant about not being able to pick a favorite shop. <laughs> we should walk around a bit more. Perhaps today is the day I finally pick one. Alright, let's see what we got. 
Oh no. A troll. I feel like we're gonna have to fight this thing. Oh snap, there's two of them. B, dodge. Okay. Time for fighting. Are we weakening him at all? Keep active! We have to wear him down! Whoa! 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 Oh man, I wish I could have stupefied him. What was that? I was trying to beat him at his own game. I let him Yeah! Look! He's faltering! Took him long enough. Let's go! We need to make sure he stays that way! LB to invoke ancient magic? No way, is that a- Troll with the punches. Goodness! A second troll! Did you two take on a fully grown troll? By yourselves? I suppose so. It's all a bit of a blur, to be honest. Merlin's beard! Are you alright? We are. And we were glad to help. I'd say help is a bit of an understatement. Nerve like that? The makings of an aura, if you ask me. If you are unharmed, perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Of course, officer. Singer. Officer Singer. And thank you, again. Dang, the troll. Defend Hogsmeade. All right. I guess we are finally going to learn Reparo. Oh, hello there. And we uh, learned anymore. ancient magic. I will see what he wants. Revelio. Okay. Nice. That was fun. I took down a troll. That's what's up. Reparo. Reparo. Okay, they didn't do more damage. That's cool. All right, what about here? Man, I'm so glad I can finally use this weapon. <laughs> I'm so glad I can finally use this. I've been trying to use Reparo on, on all of, on anything in Hogwarts and I still couldn't get it working. One less thing for Officer Singer to worry about. One less thing to offer. Ayo, hey let's go. Reparo. Reparo. My dude is just standing there. <laughs> North Hogsmeade. Let's go. That's what's up. Oh, there's more here. No problem. Got it. We got Reparo, and then we got... Uh... And we got Lavioso, and we got Lumos, and we got Axio. Basically, a lot of words that start with the word O. Or end with the word O. Much better. Much, much better. Speak to the shopkeeper. <laughs> 